Hey loves and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Myra and before we start today's video, I want to announce something super, super exciting. I am going to be in New York with McCart for a Pink Squad takeover. It's going to be me as well as Natalie Carmona and Chon Legend. It's a meet and greet with Chon Legend and Natalie and myself will be doing demos and getting to meet everybody and it's going to be so, so fun. So all of my detail or all of the details are on my Instagram page um, as well as like the address, the times, where it's going to be. It is going to be in Flushing, New York at a beauty supply store. Um, so see you guys there. I have been talking about it a lot and I'm just, I, it gets me so happy and so excited every time I talk about it. It's in a few weeks, and I can't wait to meet all of you guys there. So, in today's video, I am going to be using mostly McCart products. Um, this beautiful acrylic, which is one of my favorite acrylics that they have. It's their all-in-one acrylic, and it's in the color Show Off. It's a beautiful nude color, and it has no pink in it. It's just, you know, a nude color, and I absolutely love it. Um... And then I am going to be using one of their newest products that I just got, which is their Disco Liners. I have done a video before here on my YouTube channel using the Disco Gel Polishes, which are different because these are liners. And let me tell you guys, they did not disappoint. They're so pigmented, so pretty, and I can't wait to show you guys what it looks like. So it does come with more colors, but of course, I only do four of my nails for video purposes, and so I only chose four colors. There's also a blue, a purple, a green, and I can't remember what other ones, but it does come with more. But I decided to choose the pink, orange, red, and yellow just to stay, like, you know, in that color scheme. And it came out so cute, this design. So, of course, I'm going to keep in my acrylic application because it's my favorite, favorite part of doing nails. And let's see. The tips. Sorry, I got like my mind went a little blank for a second. Um, the tips that I'm using are the 3XL square no C-curve or C-curve tips from Crafts by Nine. Um, the pink Dappen Dish is also from Crafts by Nine along with the pink heart art palette um and then the nail brush oh my god what's going on with my brand this morning i just woke up like five minutes ago but i wanted to do these voiceovers <laughs> but um the acrylic brush is from kiara's sky and you guys can use my discount code which is myra10 the monomer is also from Kiara Sky, as you probably already know. If you are not new here, then you know that that is my number one favorite monomer and the only one that I've been using for a super long time. And um, yeah, I wanted to keep in the whole application. Even though these are longer, I really loved how it applied. The McCart acrylic works really great, especially for beginners. Um, it gives you enough time to move it around. I am the type of person that always dips my brush into my monomer and I always leave it super wet for some reason. Um, and I think it's just the way I'm used to working with other acrylics, like certain acrylics. Like I have mentioned before, it all has to do with the brand. So there are brands that uh, are slower. There are brands that are faster and it just has to do with you getting to know those certain brands. And I know there's some people that say that's not true, but it really is, you guys. I like have been using acrylics for years and years and years. And I have come in contact with so many different brands. And I have been using the same, like two monomers. When I first started doing nails, I used this particular monomer. And then I switched over to the Kiara Sky one, which is my holy grail. But... It is universal. You can use it with any brand. Basically, every single brand that I have ever used works and pairs well with Kiara Sky Monomer. Now, it just has to do with the consistency that the acrylic brings itself. So you can use a wet bead for all of the acrylics that you use, all of the companies, and they're all going to work differently. You can use a dry bead or, you know, you have a dryer 
um, brush when you're picking up a bead, and there's still going to be a different consistency. The amount of monomer that you pick up has nothing to do with the consistency of the brand um, acrylic itself. There's some that I said are runnier, there's some that are drier, and it just has to do with you getting to know it. After the first time that I have a new um, acrylic brand, I'm like, oh, okay, this one works this way. Oh, this one works this way. After the first time. And after the first time, I'll remember like, oh, I remember like, you know, I'll just pick up a dryer bead or I'll just pick up a wetter bead. And it's something that you can adapt to, you know. Don't think that it's a bad acrylic just because it's drier or it's runnier. Um, it's just, you know, having to work with it. And I work with many different acrylic brands, many different acrylics, and I can tell you that I can work with most of them. Um, it just has to do with practicing and knowing what kind of bead to pick up. But yeah, now I'm going to grab one of our newest products from our website, craftsby9.com, which is our nail art brush set. It comes with a whole set, but I'm using one in particular, which is the liner brush number two, one of the sides and oh, i just love these brushes so much i've been using them for a while you know when i first tested them out and then when we decided that that you know that was our brushes it's just amazing and you guys know that i don't do too much of nail art um i'm definitely trying to get out of my comfort zone lately and doing nail art in our disney series and stuff and doing things that i normally wouldn't have done years ago and these make it a breeze so right here, I'm just doing the French tip outline and I'm using Hint Hint, a new product that is launching on Crafts by Nine very soon, which is our black gel polish. It is so pigmented. This is one, only one um, coat. And I can't tell you how happy I am with our final product. I'm not showing you the actual bottle or anything yet because it is still in the manufacturing process so we still haven't received the final um ones this is just one that i was trying out from a supplier and this is it so i'm so excited honestly at the end ours the one that we got is a little bit more pigmented um and i'm just so excited to get it and to finally start using it but look at that it is unbelievably unbelievably opaque it is amazing. Um, so I only did one coat of that. I didn't need to go in for more. And then I cured it in the lamp for 30 seconds. And now I'm going to go in with the gel liners. So that is a card that McCart sent over with all of the um, disco gel liners. And now I'm going to do an outline. I decided to do a little bit different because I usually stick to the same thing when, I, when it comes to doing French tips. But I wanted to do something a little bit different. Um, and something I have been wanting to do. So I outlined right at the top of where the French tip starts. And I just did like a really thin outline using these gel disco liners. And look at how pigmented these liner are. Like they're so beautiful. My favorite color, as you guys know, is red and yellow. Those are my two favorite colors. And I had to use them for this set. And then that pink is absolutely beautiful gorgeous and so is the orange but you guys know my favorite color is yellow and red so now i'm putting on that clara ring um, from our website crafts by nine and i'm topping it off with the mccart top coat that i received from their august your nail lab box and it is so beautiful now i'm using the not polish cuticle oil and i'm all done with this set I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's something very simple, but it looks amazing. So I hope you guys liked today's video. Here are all the colors that come in the Disco Gel Liner set from McCart. And don't forget to use my discount code with them, which is Beauty by Myra. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.